Hi, my friends. From now on, we use uh, Autodesk Inventor Professional 2021. One of the new features of this uh, version is the black background. Let's use it. You have to activate options and to choose dark pre-release with a message that this uh, pre-release is continued to be enhanced in time. Continue. I'll choose also dark for the background of the screen, not only uh, the ribbons and other uh, dialog boxes apply. Okay. There is a time till uh, this is applied, so you have to wait. But then, look how it looks. Let's open the model of yesterday. You see? It's very nice. Let's create a sketch. Here. A sketch with the a new contour. The lines are uh, magenta. Interesting. Finish sketch. Extrude this on 10. Okay, it looks interesting. We'll use for a while this dark theme. Let's see how is uh, the drawing. Drawing is also like in the past, which is uh, very nice, in my opinion. Very nice. But uh, these are not our theme for today. Today we'll discuss about multibody. Let's see what is this concept multibody about. So let's consider just this uh, object. I. Uh, place the cursor to the first feature created and I select move EOP marker and this is, was our first volume in creating this part. Then I delete all features below EOP. Okay. Now I want to change something to this sketch to eliminate that uh, clearance and then to extend a line and to trim the end. finished sketch. Now I know that there is no clearance here. Then I want to create a mold to uh, obtain this object. To do this I create a plane below the part with 10 millimeters minus 10. Then I create here 
on this plane a sketch. The sketch is a rectangle, actually a square. 250, 250. Extrusion of this object on 200, but not to uh, lo to lose the inside. I want to keep the inside. I can select this option to create a new solid, not to join, uh, cut or intersect the first inside with this new new one. I want to create this parapiped new object. Okay. Now I know that inside this, let me make this not visible, the plane, the plane, not visible to have all the image. I know that inside this is uh, the part. Let's see. View, half section view, starting from here. You see, there is something inside. Okay. I can change the aspect of this. As you can see, we have now two solids. One, two. The first and the second. I change the color, only the color of this to be, say, olive green. Okay. Now I want to eliminate the solid one from the solid two. I apply combine. I select uh, the base body. This I want to be the base body which will remain after operation. And then I select the other solid, which is this one, and I apply subtract, cut. Okay, what is now inside? Let's view. Now that object is missing, not present inside. Good. The next operation is to extract that cylindrical internal body from this object. Now there is only one object here. Yes? The second solid. You can see here it disappeared from the uh, tree. Now I want to find out what is the uh, diameter of the inside. Move EOP here. Move EOP marker. And M from Monaco is the shortcut for measure. I measure this. 88. Oh, this is what I want. Move EOP to end. Now I create a sketch here, a circle with a diameter of 88, finish sketch, and I apply extrude, but not as a, a object, but as a surface. 
okay here select profile this is the profile to to the button okay now it is created this uh, surface inside the object now I want to split the this object by using the surface split select tool this is the tool activate solid this is what I want to keep both sides okay now I have also two objects here one two the second one I want to be red as a color red 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 okay now I want to extract this second object or red object from the main body to do this I activate move bodies I select which one and not on X but on Y I want to move it with 200 on Y okay more this is not good you see there is a, a feature here in browser double click and I apply 220 okay very good now I want to cut this body in two parts to do this I apply split again I select the tool the tool is this plane now I select the solid which to be split and I still want to uh, remain both solids present okay there is another object here yes this one I want to have another color the color to be say orange okay now I move this object I know the procedure this object on X yes on X with uh, also 22 F6 I make this not visible not from here but from extrusion surface visibility now you can see what I said a rudimentary mold for that part the idea is that I uh, keep all these objects together and then I uh, inject uh, plastic inside to create a an object inside this mold yes we'll use this uh, all uh, possibilities to the next tutorial this is why I uh, uh, want you to know something about bodies we can create new bodies we can move bodies and uh, everything is done uh, in the same unique eye 
PT Inventor Part That's all for the moment Thanks for watching Bye bye